Hi there, I'm Nina with Paint the Kitchen Red and today I'm so excited to tell you all about the Milty Crisplet. Now if you already have a Milty Crisplet, then you may want to skip this video and go to the next one which tells you all about how to use the Milty Crisplet. I give you step-by-step -step instructions to let you use it right out of the box. But this video is going to tell you uh, what the Milty Crisp Split is and the pros and cons and give you some information that will help you figure out if it's something that you really want to get. So let's get started. So what is the Milty Crisp Split? The Milty Crisp Split is an attachment made by the Milty company that allows your electric pressure cooker to be converted into an air fryer, which is such a genius idea. I was so excited when I found out about this product and I had to try it out and I can't tell you how impressed I am with it. So why would you want to buy a Milty Crisp Split? Well, the number one reason is that it fits your electric pressure cooker no matter what the model. Uh, so it's made for the Milty Multipot, which is the electric pressure cooker made by the Milty company. But it also fits the Instant Pot, which is the brand that I use. So here's the 8-quart Instant Pot and the 6-quart Instant Pot. As you can see, there are some notches. Um, on the lid of the Milty Crisp Lid that allow you to put it on both sizes of Instant Pot. I own both and it's really convenient for me to be able to use just one device to use on both sizes of Instant Pot. So another reason you might want to get the Milty Crisp Lid is just the amount of space it takes. It takes up very little room. If you were to buy a standalone air fryer, it's going to take up room on your counter and um, the Milty Crisp Lid can just be stored um, on top of the Instant Pot. So as an example, I just, this is how I normally store my Instant Pot with the lid on. Um, I can just put the Milty Crisp Lid on top and it doesn't take up any extra space really and it fits right under my kitchen cabinets on the counter so it's just that makes it really convenient. Um, another thing that I really like about it is the see-through glass so when you're when you have it on your instant pot and you're it's cooking you can see through it and see the progress of the cooking which I think is really a nice feature I don't think uh, other air fryers have this feature and so I think that's a really great advantage as well. So another reason uh, I think this is a great product is just the simplicity of the uh, the controls. You have the temperature, the time, and buttons to increase and decrease either of those and stop and start and that's it. So there are not a bunch of presets and buttons that you need to learn. It's just really simple and you have all the control that you need to cook whatever you want to cook. So one other advantage to using the Milty Crisp Lid is that you don't have to turn on your oven, especially in the summertime when I'm trying to save energy and I don't want to turn on the oven to heat up the house, uh, I try to use the grill. Now sometimes I don't even want to use the grill because it's so hot and I find that this is a great option because you can uh, use it for small quantities of food and it really doesn't get very hot on the outside, although it gets really hot on the inside. The outside stays, um, it doesn't give off a lot of heat. So I find that that's a really uh, convenient feature. I like the Milty Crisp Lid also because I don't have to wash as many dishes. So if I were to cook something and broil it in the oven, um, I would dirty uh, baking sheet and so that's just one more thing for me to wash with the crisp lid I can cook it right in the instant pot and that's one less dish for me to wash. The Milty Crisp Lid has a maximum temperature of 500 degrees. Most air fryers are about at 400 is the maximum temperature that you can set so that's an advantage if you wanted to cook something at a high high heat you can do that with the Milty Crisp Lid. I really like the fact that it's so easy to clean once you finish cooking if there are any splatters. I really found that I haven't had too much cleanup to do. You can just take a damp cloth and wipe it, wipe the glass and the metal housing, 
once it's completely cool and it just cleans up really easily. And finally, the price point. Uh, it's less than $50, currently priced at $49. And uh, I think that's a really great price for what you get. An air fryer would cost you quite a bit more. And um, with all the other advantages that I've mentioned, I think this is uh, just a really good value for the money. Okay, so I've given you many reasons why you might want to get the Meal the Crisp split. Now let me give you some reasons why it might not be right for you. So if you have a large family and you cook large amounts of food, uh, you may not find the Meal the Crisp split that convenient because the capacity of the basket that comes with the Meal the Crisp split is is kind of small, so you have to cook things in batches. So I don't find it to be a problem. I have a family of five. I do a couple of batches and uh, it's not an issue, but you might find that that's a disadvantage. Now air fryers are about the same, uh, have baskets of about the same diameter, but they are deeper. So uh, it looks like, or it appears that they have a larger capacity, but in in practicality, when you're using an air fryer, you want to spread the food out in a layer. You don't want to be stacking it deep because then you're not going to crisp up all the food. So um, for the most part, uh, the air fryer has the same disadvantage, I would say, as the meal the crisp lid compared to, you know, crisping food up in the oven or on the grill or in a saute pan. Um, another disadvantage uh, is the the heat given off by the product. So um, with a regular air fryer, everything is housed within the unit. So if anything gets hot, it's really contained within the housing. And so you don't really have to worry about children touching it or burning themselves for the most part. So when you first finish using the crisp lid, it's going to be very hot. There is the silicone mat that it comes with that you would place it on to protect your countertop. But like with an iron or any kind of hot appliance, just make sure that you keep it away from young children and you make sure that the cord is um, in a place where it can be tripped over. Just be careful and use common sense. Another uh, disadvantage compared to um, regular air fryers is that you have to turn the food over. So once you put your food in the basket and you're cooking, uh, cooking it with the crisp lid, um, halfway through, you may have to turn the food over. I have found that um, for some foods, it really, it, it actually does cook a little bit on the bottom because of the radiated heat. So it's not always the case, but for the most part, you do have to flip the food over and that's an inconvenience. With an air fryer basket, you can pull out the basket and shake the food up and put it back in. So that's that's just a little more easy to use. But for myself, I, I that's not an issue. I don't mind doing that. Uh, now the Mealthy Crisp Lid cannot be used uh, with an electric pressure cooker that has a ceramic or nonstick insert. So if you have a pressure cooker where the inner pot is made out of ceramic or nonstick material, according to the Mealthy Company, they don't recommend that you use this crisp lid with such an inner pot. So, and the reason is that uh, those kinds of products have an aluminum base and they're coated with these other materials like ceramic or nonstick. And so that can make the inner pot super hot and that could be dangerous or it may ruin your pressure cooker. So you can't use this with those kinds of inner pots. Okay, I hope I've given you enough information that uh, you can make a decision as to whether you want to buy the Milthy Crisp Lid. I don't generally do reviews. Uh, I, I recommend the Instant Pot, but other than that, I don't do reviews, but um, I like this product so much that I felt like I wanted to share it with um, other people and have people get as excited about it as I am. So thank you for watching the video and stay tuned for the next video which will show you all about how to use the Mealthy Crisp Lid.